Yes, sir. It's that part of the show where we, you know, link up with the celebrity people then. Nah. Yeah. 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 Nah, no, so. <laughs> you said it right, you know. What? Link up with the celebrity people then. Ah, like I said, say it again. <laughs> Let me say my own. Uh, say it Link up. It's not Abby always speaking. It's not that one. It's not Abby. 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 Link up. It's really easy. You have to spoil it. Anyway, this is the celebrity gist. And today, who are we talking about? Mm. None other but the lover man. Mm. The live. Mr. Live. Mr. Live. Mr. Live. Joro. Yeah. yeah, Joro uh, uh, Olomufin, Olomufin, yeah. right? Olomufin, yeah. That's Olomufin, okay. Now, popular relationship blogger Joro says that with the level of heartbreak and depression amongst ladies mm. who just got out of relationships, I believe it's time for ladies to have a contingency boyfriend. Mm. Wow. Now, that means a backup boyfriend. <laughs> who is a contingency boyfriend? A contingency boyfriend is a guy who fits all your criteria of a husband material, but it's your platonic friend. Mm. No sex involved. Friend zone. You talk to him often, you hang out with him, and involve him in your <laughs> daily activities. Mm. He's aware of your boyfriend. Peace, why are you laughing? Yeah, He's aware zone. of your boyfriend. <laughs> a lot of ladies are facing emotional hardship in their breakup and being rebounded by at least five guys, mm. risking high body counts till they find another boyfriend. Mm. Now he says, I strongly suggest that every lady in a relationship should have a backup boyfriend who, who she can marry six months after her breakup in order to avoid depression and the rebound waiting syndrome. Mm. Now he says 90% of men have contingency girlfriends. That's why after a breakup, men get married three months later. <laughs> Now, I'll let you know, guys know that this post has over 27,000 likes on Instagram and over 6,000 comments. So we're here waiting for your comment. What do you think, guys? Contingency boyfriend, yes or no? So. <sighs> to talk. Yeah, so. <laughs> Look, basically, all mm. he's saying is, ladies, get you a side thing, get me? You need to get a side thing. Let me show what she's trying to say before she hurts herself. Mm. Now, all she says, yeah, yeah, ladies, you need to get a side thing, you get me? Yeah. <laughs> okay, let me tell you how they should say it. Uh -huh. All they are trying to say is, uh, ladies, get your side uh, Get your uh, side thing. Uh, Any uh, question uh, today, uh, eat uh, it. Uh, 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 I want to know that. Forget all these things, we are doing. But my, my, what, what I think is that, a contingency boyfriend or girlfriend is like having that extra person just in case this one goes wrong, you jump into the next one. Yeah. You don't get, you know, that heartbreak period where you mm. start crying and start being depressed and stuff like that. Yeah. Mm. I feel that we level mm. in this current situation of the country. <laughs> you have to be smart. <laughs> you have to be wise. You know, because a car has a spare tire. True. Just in case True. you're on the highway driving, boom! Just come down. It doesn't even relate, like, until, why would you use a car? Until PHCN improve. Yeah, and you are not sure of light. You generator. Light can go, you need gen. You need gen. You understand? Gen so, spoil, you need... See, you know. I, am, I am in support. I'm in support. See, look, I'm in support. I'm in support as well, but I don't think I would call it contingency boyfriend, so what whatever would you call it, it is. A friend. Hey, uh, friend zone. Peace. Hey. Honestly. Do you, like, know, do you listen to what he said? He said yes. the guy will be taking care of you mm -hmm. like your boyfriend. Yeah. yeah. He will do every we give you time. He'll give you uh, money, everything, but you guys won't, won't be sexually that's related. That is a friend. But now that's a friend. Yeah, yeah, that is a friend. No, wait, wait, let me bust your bubble. Now, this guy is a like he's a total replica of what your boyfriend should be like. Yeah. It's just that you guys are not in a sexual relationship. I've Abby? said it before. But you know yeah. that it's very easy to slip, you know, when you have exactly your boyfriend. Just exactly. not that, just the title is missing. It's very easy to just just switch. Yeah, just switch. This, That's cheating the thing, your boyfriend, no, no, no. By the this way. is this is how I see it. Okay. Yeah. Basically, you Auntie have your ladies. boyfriend, right? Yeah. And then you have this other guy that is probably just your friend, but maybe has the characteristics of your, your boyfriend. boyfriend. Uh -huh. But the difference, why it might not be as easy as you think to actually move, is that when you actually, when you're dating someone, you get to know them deeper. Mm. Okay, yes. Okay. Let me so then there's actually that difference Can between I that person and... Can I paint a scenario for you? I feel that, yeah. There is, Can there I is a, a tendency of following that guy That's what I'm saying. You're in the there. club like you're in the club with your boyfriend normally, but this time yeah. your boyfriend is out of town, and you're in the club with this guy that's a replica of your boyfriend, and guys are like, you know, excited and all that, then next thing you just kiss. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what <laughs> what just say? happened? What just happened? Do you know what she'll say? Do you know what she'll say? She'll say, ah. <laughs> Let's not let just this let this be between us. Let it just be between us. It was us. a mistake. And let it be the last. So no. let it happen again. You know what's funny? <laughs> Something's happened to 
someone I know. Yeah, it's okay. Okay. No, no, we no, agree no. it's someone you know. Oh, yeah, someone you we know. agree. No, no, no. So she was with this guy. Uh, yeah. And the truth and is, was she this. was with... No, no, no. no. We agree. So with this guy, but she was with other people. Like, she, was, she had another person she was with. But I think the guy really liked her. I'm not going to give any names. Okay. The guy really liked her. Name, and then out yeah. of the blue, they had this um, this quarrel where he caught... Like, he, he had been... The guy has been doing full-time investigation. Okay. He's been following this Who, guy that she's been with. Or yeah. the guy she's been with. This guy she's with now. Yeah. She, he's been going through her phone for months. Okay. And there's this particular guy she's, he's, she's been talking to. So mm -hmm. basically, she confronted her about it later on, and they discussed it and whatnot, and she denied it flat. They broke up, basically, because mm -hmm. they had his proof. Mm -hmm. They broke up. Later, like, months later, let's say a month later, he came back, and mm -hmm. then he, he asked her, like, he gave her a sum of money, a big amount of money, mm -hmm. randomly transferred it to her account. Mm -hmm. And then he, he meets up with her, and is like, I actually want to marry you. Oh. Would you actually say yes if I proposed to you? And she oh. said no. Mm. The wow. next week, following week, he got engaged. And uh, now she said no now. She said what? She said no now. Wait, 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 wait. You want him to wait here again? Come she on, don't please, lock up. they go now. So he had a contingency. Wait, wait, hang on, hang on. No. But why didn't you? He did. But he still sent her money. Did he collect the money back? No, but he had a sighting, though. Did he collect the money back? Because you didn't meet someone in one week and then get engaged no, to no, them. No, no, no. Do you know that if someone wants to get married, you can meet someone in one week and get married to them. Yeah, you just, know, you just want to spend the rest of your life with this person. Person is ready. I meet you like this. We know ourselves. How yeah. are you doing? Actually, this journey is to, to marriage, Joe. We know where yeah, we're we know going. Yeah, we know where it's going. You agree? We agree. So basically, what you're trying to tell me, because I've actually been looking for this answer. When a guy sees a girl, he already knows. If he's gonna be with her or not. Ninety percent, yeah. One time, yeah. ninety percent. Yeah. A guy oh. knows what he wants yeah. to use a lady for when he yeah. sees her the first time. Yeah. I if thought that if he's as gonna well. marry or if it's just a yeah. chick that he wants to have on the side. They are two different things. So, so you, you, you know, you don't need a uh, yeah. you don't no. need a year. No. To no. Know. You if guys are gonna be honest to themselves, they, they actually you know, know who would fit into yeah. that person you want to live yeah. with the rest of your life. Besides that, they're just playing games. So within a week, you'd know. You would know. See, so men, did you know? Auntie. Why, why, why? <laughs> so wait, 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 wait. I so told you guys. No, Caesar didn't know about when he did the proposal. I wasn't sure. <laughs> So did you know? He wasn't he, sure. He said it. Uh, well, you know, he just said to me that Caesar you would was know. Caesar was I, I told you there is oh. rehearsal for a movie. It's coming out soon. It's a Come movie. On. It's Come broken guys. proposal. Yeah. Are you guys seeing what these guys are doing? Are you guys seeing this? But the, the question is still out there. I know that people will be saying, ah, no, it's like this. You can't be If you are faithful to one, be faithful to one. Stay there and be and, and die there. Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> Stay and die for there. me, I've said it before. <laughs> Uh, it's good to have a spare tire because if you are driving on this Lagos road that there's potholes, <laughs> it can box your tire. Ladies in Lagos. Have, yeah, yeah, just have uh, a spare tire. Now, don't you know that if the four tires are good, you will never need the spare tire. True, that's a good point though. So if my that's four tires good are though. good yeah. and I'm running the highway and it's keeping me safe, I will never need a spare tire. That's, 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 I don't you know, understand what this guy is nuggets, saying, but whatever. You know, that's, that's, yeah. yeah. that's the deepest point. Whatever. That's the deepest point. tire is good, you don't need a spare tire. So if you're... <laughs> <laughs> I don't know that. Don't know. But it's true now. So guys, you know how it is now. Like, we bring to you on the show, we bring you that thing that you need to talk about. And sometimes it'll prick your mind. You'll be like, wait, am I in this position? Mm, you know how yeah, today, today, am I your contingency oh. plan? <laughs> Damn you, let me know before I go and get my own peace. So, what you Joro is saying, in yes. other words, he has a sighting, innit? I'm Joro so. has a side babe, yeah. Abby. Yeah, but yeah, so, all, you know. all in support of a <laughs> contingency plan, say aye. Aye. All uh, against, say nay. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, so with your so contingency wins it. Contingency Joe, wins it. The eyes have it. <laughs> the eyes have it. Ladies and gent <laughs> gentlemen, we are leaving you in the arms of an amazing week ahead. To enjoy more of this, our will go get videos when you just watch. Press this button to subscribe on top of our YouTube page. You go love her.